And only on CBS 13, dramatic video of the guy who shot and killed Officer N being taken down by a neighbor. As police say, he was trying to kill his eight-year-old son by strangling him. This tense scene highlighting the life or death situation playing out outside that Stockton home. CBS 13's Renee Santos is live with more on that video and new details about the suspect's criminal history. Renee. Yeah, large bullet holes remain outside the home where this all unfolded. That video for some may be hard to watch. It shows that young boy being choked by his own father when out of nowhere someone tackles him to the ground. We're learning that suspect has a criminal past in several counties. In video you'll see only on CBS 13, a hero tackles a suspect to the ground after he's seen choking his own eight-year-old son. He should be recognized for that. Carlos Soto is grateful for the heart and courage in the man seen in the video. He can't imagine what the young boy was feeling in those terrifying moments. Now proud of the Good Samaritan that stopped the violent attack. Man, blessed. You know, have someone like that around us that, you know, did that heroic action. The suspect seen choking and pinning his son to the ground has been identified as 30-year-old Lance Lowe. The California Department of Corrections and Rehabilitation says Lowe was recently released from prison in Los Angeles County. He was sentenced to five years in prison in 2018 for grand theft auto, where a gun was involved, but released on parole last April. He also had marijuana charges dating back to 2009. To see a grown man choke out a, uh, a little boy in front of so many people. Esteban Chavez says without the mysterious hero, the violent situation could have been worse. Uh, this gentleman, we don't know who it was, uh, seen an opportunity to take the man down. Uh, thank you so much. You, you really saved uh, that little boy's life and, and potentially others. A day later, what happened here is still traumatizing for neighbors. Coming up at 6, why one woman says she believes that suspect did what he did. All right, thanks, Renee.